I'm going to call the client right now and go ahead and chit chat with them and let them know that the watch is indeed fake. Huh? Hey, how are you? Hey, thanks for calling me about that watch. Yeah, man, I just wanted to make sure you didn't touch it or do anything silly with it because, yeah, that watch is 100% fake. The guy's got, he's got it posted, he's got a, kind of a too good to believe price. How much is he asking? Five grand. Yeah, that's obviously another tell. It never fails. Every time I get a fake watch offered to me, there's always a long elaborate story about how somebody's going through a divorce or how they're sick or how their car needs this and that and or it was a gift, etc. But yeah, typically um, anything that's too good to be true is always you know, too good to be true. So I'm glad you dodged it. It's lucky that we caught it now because there's a lot of scams running around now where they fish people with real watches. They tell you to bring cash because they need their cash strap. And some of them actually have believable price points. And the next thing you know, you drive an hour or two hours away and you're getting robbed at a gas station.